let's learn about cone okay what is a cone cone is a surface which is generated by locus of straight lines that pass through a fixed point and intersect a given curve or touches a surface okay so let's just assume i have a curve okay and i have a fixed point okay now my cone is the locus of straight lines that intersect this curve and pass through this point okay so it's going to be something like this okay so this is the all set of lines that pass through this fixed point and intersect this given curve okay so i have not shown you the whole line in an unbounded fashion actually line doesn't have bounds right so it's going to be extended in this direction and extended in this direction i have just shown you a part of this cone and it looks like this this curve is known as guiding curve okay these lines are known as generators okay sometimes also referred as generatrix and this fixed point is known as the vertex sometimes also referred as apex okay so this is a cone which is set of lines which pass through a fixed point and intersect a given curve okay in general the equation of a cone is going to be something like this it's going to be a function of x y z equal to 0 when this equation is of degree 2 we say our cone is quadratic okay so what is a quadratic curve quadratic curve or rather quadratic cone is a cone having equation of this type with degree 2 okay another way to define your quadratic cone is to say that it is the cone having guiding curve as a conic okay what are your conics circle ellipse parabola hyperbola rectangular hyperbola are your conics so if your guiding curve is a conic or essentially it is a equation in two variables of degree 2 then you get a quadratic cone so essentially my quadratic cone is of this type and has a degree 2 we are basically going to be concerned only with quadratic cones okay let's find out the equation of a cone with vertex at the origin okay we are just assuming that my function of x y z is of this type we have ax square plus by square plus cz square plus 2f into yz plus 2g into zx plus 2h into xy plus 2ux plus 2vy plus 2wz plus d equal to 0 so this is a general equation of this type we are going to see if we get some pattern in this particular equation when the vertex is at origin okay since vertex is at origin so it basically means 0, 0,0,0 is a point lying on the cone therefore it must satisfy this equation okay therefore when you're going to replace x y and z with 0 0 0 then you should get the result 0 okay because it must satisfy this equation so this is 0 this is 0 this is 0 this is 0 this is also 0 this guy is also 0 this guy is also 0 this guy is also 0 and this is also 0 so essentially what you are left with is d is equal to 0 so one thing we know for a cone having a vertex at origin is that it does not have a constant term okay let's find out if we know something else let's just suppose this is the cone having its vertex at origin okay so this is origin let's just